I think Walt would want every kid to be treated special whenever you're there. I mean, that's the whole reason why he opened it. Thousands of people visit Disney World every day, but one Bay Area family says their experience has been ruined after Disney changed their disability pass rules. They say the new guidelines make it much more difficult to navigate their favorite destination with their child. News Channel 8's Alessandra Young explains. Disney World is known for being the happiest place on earth, but for one South Tampa family, they say the magic is now gone after their son couldn't get the accommodations that he needs. Do you say cheese? Cheese. Tony Lynn McElreath is an annual Disney pass holder and enjoys taking her three-year-old <laughs> twins to Magic Kingdom. Her son Luke is on a feeding tube. One of the common things with this condition um, or having a feeding tube is you vomit frequently. Um, especially if you are overstimulated. In the past, they have had access to Disney's Disability Access Service Pass. We went through the renewal process and we were denied. Um, so I went for the first time yesterday and had to wait in the normal queue. And we were in line for Prince Charming's uh, carousel and Luke vomited. With the pass, she says they would choose their attraction and were just given a time to show up. We could make sure that he's had a feed and his stomach was empty for us to be able to get onto that ride. So that way, if he gets overstimulated and starts gagging, he won't, there's nothing in his stomach to throw up. On Disney's website, they say they have an unwavering commitment to providing a welcoming and inclusive environment. They say DAS is meant for guests who have a developed mental disability like autism or a similar disorder to not have to wait in the normal lines. Margarita says she um, understands why the rules were changed. You know, I understand people take advantage of some of these programs, we were ones who never took advantage. But the mother of two says having the past made the experience more enjoyable for her son and the entire family. It's sad that, you know, they're almost taking the magic away from us. I reached out to Disney World, but we're still waiting on a response back from them. In Tampa, Alessandra Young, 8 on your side.